everyone. Thanks for joining in today for a training on how to schedule exams to test your candidates and examinees from home. The purpose of this video is to walk you through how to schedule exams and answer some common questions that come with scheduling exams online. You will first want to log on to your Certiport account at certiport.com and make sure you have the organization administrator, member, or proctor role. You can reach the schedule exams page through the organization administrator or member role by hovering your mouse over the Training and Tools tab and clicking Schedule Exams. You can also reach this page for the Proctor role by clicking the Schedule Exams option at the top. Once you have reached the Schedule Exams from Home page, you will find some important information regarding our calendar, online testing, and just some steps for the booking process. Please read this information before scrolling below and looking at the options for scheduling an exam. You will see that the top three options are for all pro anyone who's looking to test their candidates using any program except for Autodesk. There's a one to five Canada option, one, six to 10 Canada option, and a one to two Canada option for those who are looking to test candidates in a, with accommodations or extended time. Just below that is an option for all Autodesk exams that are one to five candidates or that also have accommodations or extended time. Once you have found the booking that is right for you, please click on the C times option in which a time zone will be displayed that should match your computer. If this doesn't match up, please click on the box and find the time zone that does match. Once you have found that, you will see some times listed below. You may not see your time available, and if you do not, please skip forward to coming weeks to find other options open. You can also skip forward to schedule future exams. Once you have found a time that works for you and your candidates, please choose that time where you will find um, an area to enter some of your information. We please ask that you do not enter any candidate information as only exam administrators or those from testing centers can schedule exams. You will enter your name, your email address, which all information, including your testing links will be sent to, phone number for reminders, your Certiport ID or your customer ID, the total number of test candidates which will be testing, and the type of exams that your candidates will be testing with. Please note that if you are testing with the all programs except Autodesk option, you can test your candidates in multiple different programs. Just below that, um, you will see a box for you to check saying that you did not use any candidate information and that it is your information and that you give us permission to use your information to make bookings. Once you've done that, click the book option below. One of the commonly asked questions after scheduling is what do I do now? And how can I make sure I am prepared for testing day? We have some training pages that will help prepare you and your candidates for testing day. You can reach these pages by going back to the schedule exams page here. And on the left side of the screen, you will see an EFH links column with exam administrators and a test candidate option. If you click on the exam administrators option, it will take you to another page um, that will have steps for scheduling a session, which we went over, some technical requirements, user training, identity and environment check, exam checklist or exams that we offer, and some frequently asked questions. I highly recommend that you watch the user train training video here, which will walk you through the process of proctoring online. Just below that, there's also a guide and some other information for testing from home. Now, if we go back to the page um, for scheduling exams and click on the Test Canada option, there is similar information that shows up here uh, pertaining to test candidates. I highly recommend as well that you have your candidates watch this um, user training video that will walk them through things that they need to know, things they need to be prepared for, and how to sign in to take their exam from home. Please note all this information is also included in an email that is sent to you up to 24 hours prior to your testing session, which will also include the links that you need to proctor and the links that your candidates need to take their exams. This is kind of what the um, emails will look like. You'll have a greeting for taking exams from home, the time in which you are scheduled to test, some important guidelines for our self-service or exams from home option. Included will be those videos that we um, looked at earlier 
for the exam administrator and one for the test candidate. Um, I really recommend this exam from home checklist as it kind of goes through all the steps that are um, required or necessary for a successful and uh, positive experience. Just below this will be the exam administrator link, which is for the proctor, how they will access their link five minutes before the, the scheduled session to uh, get things started up and prepare to proctor your candidates. Below that are some steps for the candidate links. It, it asks that you please send only one link per student so links don't get mixed up so that candidates can access their, their test um, the following day at the time that you've scheduled. Um, all this information is also in, is also located on our website at certiport.com slash exams from home. Um, please visit that website if you have any other questions and thanks for joining us today. Hope you have a great day.